the moon is holding the pending traumas and pain of humanity. She was extracted from the earth at the end of our previous feminine era, Lumeria. Just as we are facing the end of an era now, a splitting of worlds and moving into a new phase of our evolution. She is acting as a mirror reflecting back to us our wounded feminine shadow aspects that still needs healing and integration so we can come into balance. So many stories is circulating in the new age community that the moon is a controlling base for humanity and earth is a prison planet. This is not true. She acts as a locking mechanism. When you die or lay down your physical vessel, the wounded parts of you that you fail to heal will be the reason you get recycled life after life, known as reincarnation, until you have the courage to face yourself. You have free will, the way out is always through the heart, Christ consciousness, through transmutation of your pain, will you ascend out of matter, through the moon lock, into higher consciousness. When you are unwilling to look at your shadow and turning your back on God and your heart, this is when fear controls you. You feel stuck and go in a downward spiral. Psychic ability is the same. These are all reflections channeled from the person's lower aspects that needs to be transmuted into light. The Divine Feminine is asking of you to not fear these darker aspects of you. Within you is so much beautiful gifts and potential waiting to shine after the inner work has been done. Do not be scared to heal these shadow parts. This is your way out of here. We have done this many, many times before. We are now in an ascending phase. If you choose the descending path, you will be stuck and moving further away from remembering your divinity and you will turn your back further on yourself and God. If you choose the ascending path of Christ consciousness, freedom, and unconditional love is waiting. Please like, subscribe and share this message on your social media platforms.